Hello, my name is Dr. Paul Choi. I am the director of Los Angeles Endoscopy Center. I am also a fellow member of American Gastroenterological Association. In this audio presentation, I'll be discussing cholesterol. Cholesterol is an important substance that is used to form cell membranes and produce various hormones. It is a vital and necessary component of human body. Among foods that we eat, fatty and greasy food in particular have a high concentration of cholesterol. Once ingested, cholesterol is processed in the liver and distributed throughout the body. If the concentration of cholesterol is too high, however, it is distributed not only to various organs for essential body function, but is deposited and accumulated in the blood vessel. When this process becomes chronic and extended, the blood vessel becomes narrowed, impeding the flow of blood. This is analogous to what happens to the water pipe when it becomes rusted as the flow of water is reduced due to the clogging of the pipe. This process is aggravated in patients with high blood pressure, diabetes, or in those who smoke. When this process occurs in the heart, angina or heart attack may develop. If the narrowing occurs in the blood vessel supplying the brain, a stroke may result. When the artery supplying the kidney is affected, the kidney function may become compromised. There are four types of cholesterol that are routinely monitored. The normal total cholesterol level is 200 mg per deciliter or less. The bad cholesterol or LDL is thought to be the main culprit in the narrowing of the blood vessel. The accepted level of LDL is less than 140. The good cholesterol or HDL is thought to protect the blood vessel and should be greater than 40. There are many reasons for the elevation of cholesterol, including obesity, lack of exercise, and inherited conditions. However, the most frequent cause is probably due to the foods that we eat. Among foods that we consume, those that are high in cholesterol include beef, bacon, and liver. Eggs, butter, regular milk, cheese, and ice cream also have high cholesterol content. Fast food such as pizza, hamburger, and french fries are known to have a high concentration of cholesterol. In addition, shrimp, and clans have a very high level of cholesterol. On the other hand, fish and chicken are low in cholesterol content. Fruit, vegetable, and vegetable oil are low in cholesterol content as well. To prevent the potential complications, including heart condition and stroke, it is very important to avoid foods that are high in cholesterol. In addition, it is advisable to maintain proper body weight, exercise regularly, and avoid smoking. If the total cholesterol remains elevated, despite these measures, then medical treatment with a class of medications called statin are often indicated. 
Thank you for listening.